Hey, what is going on everyone? This is Adam over here in Atlanta. And today I'm gonna to go over the back office. I'm also gonna go over how to change a coupon um, for the plus services. I'm also gonna go over how to change um, the messages, among other things, and kind of show you what it looks like. And just some other cool stuff too that might be helpful. Um, so with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and share my screen. And right now, we are in the back office. I'm going to bring this down here. Um, so obviously, I'm going to hit login. And here we go. There's that. And then I'm going to go to services. Um, once I go to services, I'm going to go to, go to units. And wow. Internet's actually pretty fast today. So once I go here, it's going to give you all of the um, you know messages that I have on there. But we'll go into that in a second. So right here, you have your dashboard, which gives you the um, gives you all your analytics on how many clicks that that you have. So uh, let's see how many days: one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I guess it gives you the last eight days. Um, uh, analytics. So eight days ago, I was at a really big event, and that's why the spike is so big back here. Um, I went to another event uh, last night, and so that's why that was so big right there. Um, but that's this is where all of your analytics are going to be. Um, it, they're color coded, so that way it's pretty easy to identify which ones are working, which ones are not. So now we're going to go into the deals part, which I think is probably one of the cooler parts, and I'm going to go through on how to make a new deal. So <clears throat> with that being said, right here, you have the new deal button, right? And so we're going to go ahead and click on that. Once we click on that, it's going to give you a few different options to choose from. So all the ones that have the red asterisk next to it, those are required. So you can choose a file, right? You can choose a picture, whatever you want to choose. Um, we're just going to do something, I don't know. Just basic. So let's say we were, let's say we're gonna do this one right, and we we're gonna do 50% off on wedding venue, right? And more details are gonna be, uh, I don't know, uh, 50 people or more, right? I don't know. Uh, business name, I think this one's called uh, the Bell. The bell in the cabin. Bell in the cabin. Um, and then you can also put an address in there just for you know purposes. We're gonna uh, go ahead and put this one in there, just some random address in Fort Lauderdale. I guess I typed in a while back. And you go ahead and select the state. Let's go in here. And you can put expiration date. Let's just put it the October 31st, right? And you can put a random phone number, whatever you want to do, and um, we'll just use jvcevents.com. Don't know what it is, just a random example address. So we're going to go ahead and hit submit, and your deal's done. So now your deal is going to be all the way, or not all the way, but it's going to be at the bottom of it because that's going to be the one where you just recently did it, right? And so kind of a, a quick preview, this is what it'll look like, right? And it is not on your beacon just yet. But you can see right here it says the deal has been added. So what we're going to do now is we're going to go into the beacons and we're going to change the message. So right now all of my messages are on the basic, which is just the message itself. And if I want to switch over to the Go Plus services, I just click Deal. Right? You see how it kind of changed right there. Um, and then right here it's going to ask me to select one. So these are all of my deals that I've done in the past, right? Um, free Oreos, whatever, whatever you want to do, right? And so the one that we just did was the 50% off wedding venue. So we can go ahead and click on that. We'll click update, and your beacon's updated. Um, I found that the deals actually update faster than the messages, although the messages only take about maybe three minutes to populate, if that. Uh, normally they're they're you know pretty quick. So once you hit update, it's right there, and then you can click this green arrow box looking thing as a preview of what it'll look like on the actual phone. Same thing. Um, with these, if it's just the plus, or I'm sorry, if it's just the basic, it's going to take you to the website that they click on, right? 
Um, so here we go. This is what it's going to look like when you have the coupon on the phone. So you can, you know, the bell in the cabin, 50% off wedding venue. Um, there's 50 people or more, so it has the, the criteria for it. And then it has where it expires, the address. They can save it to their Apple or Android wallet, which is really cool. Um, it has the phone number. The more button just takes you to the website, right? So it just takes you to the website over here. And then you can actually share this on social media also. So when you click on that, it's going to be boom, right there. You can share it, say something about it, and then post it on your timeline, which is really cool because especially, uh, for example, someone was doing this for a car dealership, and um, you know they, they thought that was really cool also, kind of creating a viral effect, if you will. So that's how you create a deal in the new back office, right? And now we're going to go through creating a new, um, a new message, right, on the regular basic platform. And we're going to use this, this beacon right here again. So now we're going to go over here. We're going to go to messages. And the one that I'm going to use is free Starbucks, which you can see I already used before, but we're going to delete that one and redo it. So... We're going to click right here. Same thing as the new deal, except the difference is this is on messages. This is the deal. So we're going to click on new message. And we're going to go ahead and put the message in this. We're going to say free Starbucks. And then the URL is going to be, you know, whatever you want it to be. It could be anything, right? And it doesn't have to be HTTPS, but in this case it is, right? Because it's Facebook. And then we're going to hit submit. <clears throat> when we hit submit, it's going to pop up at the bottom like the other one did, right? Free Starbucks right there. So now my message is in the drop down menu. So now we're going to go back to beacons, right? And this one's on the deal. So if this one's on the deal, I'm going to switch it over to the message part because that is the basic, right? This is the plus, this is the basic. So now we're going to go to select the menu on the drop down button or select the deal or the message on the drop down button and we're going to click update. Let's click update. Beacon's already updated. So there's no 24 hour, um, you know, waiting. Hopefully, you know, it, it, it updates. Now it updates instantly. Um, might take three minutes to do it. Um, and that's how you do the update of the message. And that's how you do the update of the deal. So I just wanted to make this quick video just to go ahead and, you know, show those who have, who are curious about it. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out on Facebook to me or, anyone else and I'm sure they'd be more than happy to help out. Um, you can reach me on Facebook, which should be in the description down there and look forward to helping you out. All right guys, I'll see you soon.